Welcome to Past Us. In today's video, we'll talk about top five actors who died from home improvement. What kind of sicko would breed snakes? Well, Tim, snakes are clean, low maintenance pets. Plus, they have a very firm, nutty tasting flesh. Home Improvement is an American television sitcom starring Tim Allen that aired on ABC from September 17, 1991 to May 25, 1999, with a total of 204 half hour episodes spanning eight seasons. The series was created by Matt Williams, Carmen Finestra, and David McFadzian. In the 1990s, it was one of the most watched sitcoms in the United States, winning many awards. There were many cast members in these series, they all played their best role in the sitcom. Among them, these five actors are now dead. Here's the list of top five actors who are died from home improvement. But before starting the video, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. Number five, Earl Heinemann. What kind of sicko would breed snakes? Well, Tim, snakes are clean, low maintenance pets. Plus, they have a very firm, nutty tasting flesh. Earl Joan Hyman was an American actor best known for his role as the kindly unseen neighbor Wilson W. Wilson Jr. on the television sitcom Home Improvement. The television series ran for eight years on ABC and starred Tim Allen. Long before this role, however, he played villains in two 1974 thrillers, The Taking of Pelham 1, 2, 3, and The Parallax View. Hyman played role as the wise and eccentric neighbor Wilson on Home Improvement. Hyman's most famous pre-home improvement role was as Bob Reed in Ryan's Hope. Wilson, the neighbor played by Earl Hyman, has never shown his full face in the eight-season history of the series. Longtime fans of the series may have noticed that Wilson's face hasn't been very well hidden in some scenes during the show's final listless season. You're not making me feel any better. Well, excuse me, why do I always have to be Santa's little helper? He played the role from 1975 to 1984 and later returned for its final episodes in 1988 to 1989. Hyman's wife, Molly McGreevy, was also on the soap 1977 to 1981 as Polly Longworth, best friend to media tycoon Ray Woodard. Hyman died of lung cancer on December 29, 2003 at the age of 61 in Stamford, Connecticut. Number 4. Mickey Jones that would be me. <laughs> one, two, one, two, three. Mickey Jones was an American musician and actor. He played drums with acts such as Trini Lopez and Bob Dylan, with whom he played on his 1966 world tour. After the breakup of the first edition in 1976, Jones concentrated on his career as a character actor where he made many appearances on film and television. A native of Houston, Texas, Jones worked steadily in TV from the 1970s with appearances on shows including Baywatch and TJ Hooker, and more recently, Growing Up Fisher, with J.K. Simmons and newsreaders with Kumail Nanjiani. He played Rodney Hot Rod Dunham on Justified and construction worker Pete on the 1990s sitcom Home Improvement. Well, that's pretty much a thing of the past, Tim, especially at K&B. Our new foreman left doesn't go for that kind of stuff. His home improvement role harkened back to his roots in entertainment. Pete was part of a company band using an ad hoc drum set made up of empty plastic fuel cans and with screwdrivers as sticks. Jones died at the age of 76 due to the effects of a long illness, said his publicist, Cherry Hepburn, the illness and where he died were not immediately disclosed. Number 3. Charles Robinson No, no word from the DEA. But I did learn that the ladies' room is out of paper products. Charles Robinson, a versatile actor best known for his role as the court clerk, Mac Robinson, in the long-running sitcom Night Court, Robinson was a prolific stage actor and had supporting parts in series. Robinson racked up more than 125 TV and film credits, including many impressive series regular roles during a half-century career that stretched into 2021. Robinson continued to work mostly in TV through the end of his life. He recurred on ABC's Home Improvement from 1995 to 1999 before landing yet another series regular role. Here you go. Robinson died on July 11, 2021 at Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center from cardiac arrest with multi-system organ failure due to septic shock and metastatic adenocarcinoma, a type of glandular cancer. He was 75. Number 2. Shirley Prestia I've never seen anything like it. Where's the podiatrist? I I'll go get him myself. Shirley Prestia, better known by the family name Shirley Rose Prestia, was a popular American actress. She was born in Louisiana, is a beautiful and populous city located in Louisiana, United States of America. Shirley Rose Prestia started her career as actress in 1976 
when Shirley Rose Prestia was just 29 years old. Soon, she became more successful in her profession within a limited period of time, where she influenced people on the basis of her career and earned a lot of fame. After a while, her career completed a full circle as she gained more importance. Shirley Rose Prestia went famous for her performance in her own country, United States of America, as well as in other countries. Prestia also had recurring roles on the sitcoms Home Improvement. How come you never say anything nice like that to me? <laughs> Your husband isn't as lucky. Shirley Prestia died at the age of 64 on October 6, 2011. Number 1. Al Fan. Yes, uh, maybe Stonehenge is in there. Tell me, every one of your jokes is costing you money. Al Fan was born in Cleveland, Ohio, USA, as Albert Louis Fan. He was an actor and producer known for Stop or My Mom Will Shoot, 1992. He had a recurring role as handyman Felix Maiman on Home Improvement. He played his best role on Home Improvement. You'll want to drain the water from the tank first and use an epoxy resin cement, which will take a couple of hours to dry. He died on October 14, 2018. Thank you for watching. If you liked our video, then hit the subscribe button to never miss out on any of our videos. See you next time.